Hey everyone, John Wade from Trader's Post here. This video is going to quickly show you how you can connect a trading view strategy to Trader's Post using alert webhooks. So the first thing that we're going to do over here in Trader's Post is create a new webhook. <clears throat> we'll call it the trading view strategy and we want it to be the asset class stocks and we'll allow any ticker instead of restricting it to a specific list of tickers. We'll go ahead and click save. And you'll see up here this URL, that's the URL of the webhook that we'll want to copy and we'll use that later in TradingView. So let's go ahead and create a new strategy for this webhook. We'll just call this the TradingView strategy as well. We'll make sure that the strategy is linked to the webhook and then we'll go ahead and click save. Now that the strategy in Traders Post is created, we need to connect it to a broker by subscribing to it. So let's just go ahead and click the create a subscription button. We'll connect it to the internal Traders Post paper broker. And now that's connected, let's turn on auto submit. Let's do both sides. So we'll take both bullish long trades and bearish short trades. We'll allow any ticker. It's connected to the Traders Post paper broker. It's the stocks asset class and we want to do market entry and market exit. So go ahead and click save and you'll see that you have your example entry and exit. We got the bullish example, a bearish example. And the last thing that we need to do here is just enable this strategy. We're going to do just a percent of portfolio value. So we'll put 5% of our portfolio on each position. So you can see now the quantity that's calculated increased from one to 88 which is just shy of $5,000. So this strategy subscription is now enabled. As soon as a signal comes into this webhook, it's gonna create an order in that paper broker. So let's go ahead and copy this URL here and let's move over to TradingView now and let's go to the chart. <clears throat> I'm gonna use just this simple momentum trend following strategy. And you're going to want to go over to the alerts pane on the right column and click the create alert button. And in the condition drop down, you'll want to choose your strategy and you'll want to check webhook URL and paste the webhook URL. You're going to want to give it a name. So we'll call it Momo Strategy Alert. And then the last thing that we want to do is go over to the Traders Post documentation and go to the Trading View page. And we'll just copy this JSON right here and then go back over to trading view and paste this in the alert message. It all looks good. We've got our Momo strategy selected. It's an open-ended alert and we want to send the alert to a webhook URL and we want to send this payload of information to the webhook URL. And that'll give Traders Post all the information it needs in order to execute the order that the trading view strategy executed. So that's it for this video. Thanks everyone.